Hey, so we're going to check out Tick, 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 the official teaser. Uh, I believe it's starring Jayam Ravi, Niveta Petraj. Uh, when we get the little dash in the middle, then I start thinking that D. Iman might be the director. Not sure. Could be a producer. Could be a producer. There's also Shakti Soundar Raj. Probably should have looked it up. Probably should have looked it up. <laughs> Sorry, guys. We like going into these things blind. So it, it makes it more fun. China Sabela Ulaga Medicaga Yenda Nadu, twenty kilo Tanakamela nuclear weapon produced from a Kudadan or Opanda Portanga. Anna Ulagatla in the Muli Lerka in the Nati in Takakudi or Yadatala, or two hundred kilo ton missile Lerk. India Elekula Yenda Takudal Nandala, the Patrick Namasumar Command. Joker? Yeah, that's a Batman animated adventures Joker. I wonder if they, you know, they can get away with it because nobody, like, because of the jurisdiction, huh? copyright infringements. Is this gravity? We have no idea what was going on in that trailer. They, they look like a. A sin, I don't want to say sinister, but he's throwing around Joker cards and he's giving like that that uh, mischievous eye to the camera and then all of a sudden he's in outer space. And they're talking about nuclear war? Yeah. I mean, it's kind of... I mean, it was a teaser, so... But uh, not sure what it's about. Definitely know it takes place in outer space. It looks cool. Um, yeah, it does look cool. Look the good. CGI is good. There's definitely some gravity references. Uh I yeah I don't know I don't know what the I don't know what tick 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 means, like my instinct is to assume that's like the ticking of a clock, but obviously that would be a clock or a bomb. It could be yeah, but I but obviously that's not a hundred percent accurate. I'm not basing that off of anything other than the fact that clocks go tick tick tick. I don't know because that tick tick might not even or is it tick or tick? Well, let's not assume that it's yes. tick. So I don't know. I don't even know what. Well, in, in Spanish it'd be tick. Yeah, in I Spanish it would be tick. Well, this is a bad one. This is a, not a good reaction. We're no, get hate on this. probably our worst reaction video <laughs> so far. Um, I don't know. We there's not much. To, if there's another trailer for that, please let no, us know. No, it's not. Is that's that the only t- one. Yeah, they yeah. just posted it a few days ago. So, is that popular because of the actor? Like, you guys know the actor, and that's why you're like you're excited about it, or the filmmaker? Because they did drop like from the filmmaker who made whatever that movie was called. Right. Sorry, with an M. I don't know how to pronounce it. Sorry. Uh, you know, I don't know if that was a bigger movie. And so this is like a follow up to it, not necessarily a sequel, but like his next big thing. Right. Like, this could be the Christopher Nolan of of Indian movies. I don't know. Uh, but like I said, the, the CGI looked cool. Uh, I'm all for space. Like Gravity was one of my favorite movies. I don't think you I don't think you've seen Gravity. I've never seen Gravity. Yeah. Um, but I love all that uh, Interstellar and 2001 A Space Odyssey, like that type of thing. Um, you know, I didn't see Gravity. I don't because you're lame. Because everybody told me you have to see it in the theater. You have oh, to see it. In well, the you theater. do. You and do then by the time, see. like, I had time to actually see it in the theater, it was gone. So I just haven't bothered watching it. But uh, yeah, this looks good. It, 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 it I kind of got a Call of Duty feel to this movie. Uh, the trailer, actually, I don't know. Well, you haven't played the last few Call of Duties, but they've been in space, and there's been like space combat. Like, there's a there's a shot in this trailer where like there's clearly soldiers of right. some kind walking in the hallway. I'm assuming that's in the space station. I stopped playing Call of Duty when it became Halo. Yeah, that's fair. Do you guys game out there? I'm assuming you guys game in India, but I don't know if you're what, listening. Uh, to this. If you are gamers, what are your favorite games? Yeah, Xbox, PlayStation, PC. What do you guys do? I uh, I do everything. I think Gian is a PlayStation guy. Uh, yeah, well, I'm a whatever console I have happen to have at the time <laughs> guy when I have time to play, which is <laughs> once a month, so... You know, definitely not a PC guy. I've never been a PC gamer, but uh, that's, why, that's why he's lame. That's why he didn't that's see gravity. Why I'm lame. Is that why? Yeah. You know, the funny thing about gravity, I know this is this reaction isn't about gravity, but every single person except for Daniel said the exact same thing. Oh, you got to see it in the theater. Yeah, because if you see it at home, it's just not much going on. It's not that great. Every single person. It's if you see it in the theater, it's going to be like you know. But it's true. It's, it's like there's no story at all, and there's really not much going on. But the visuals are so great, and the sound, the sound is so great. You need to go. Did to you a place see? Did you did sound. you see Spielberg's first movie, Duel? 
Of course not. Okay, well... You didn't see it until you saw it in the class. Yeah, I know, but I've seen it now. Well, Duel is basically a chase film. It's just one long chase. There's not really a story other than the fact that the guy's getting chased by a big 18-wheeler. Right. Gravity's kind of like that. There's a reason Dunkirk that, is kind of like that. There's a reason why Duel isn't in the, the pantheon of Spielberg. Like People don't talk about that movie. Well, it's because it's a TV movie, but it's, it was a highly regarded film. It got a lot of cr- praise from like Hitchcock and a lot of the well, people you don't necessarily regard, like the French New Wave people. Eh. Exactly. Yeah. But anyway, uh, we're we're curious. I'd watch the next trailer of this, like the official trailer, just to kind of get a better scope of what's actually going on. Yeah, because from this, we didn't really get much from it. There's, you know, I mean, they drop things, but a lot of things are to be inferred, and I'm and I'm actually curious to know, like, what the what world is, is. Yeah, what is being inferred? Is this an alternate universe? Is and then the the production side, like, is this actor? Is he a huge actor? Yeah, you know, or the that, filmmaker, yeah, or et cetera, et cetera. Because obviously there's money involved in this. Or I don't know. I don't know. Is this an expensive movie? Because this would be an expensive movie in America. Let's just be honest. It would be. Right. But someone told me that Bahu Bali only costs like $30 million, Which by our standards, if we made a $30 million movie that made that look like that. Oh, we'd be, we'd be kings. Yeah. <laughs> because, I mean, that's how much it should cost. Let's be realistic. It goes back to like we mentioned on our other on a other reaction video, um, it goes back to the unions and the the unions in the uh, genetic states, and there there that's a real big reason why movies cost so much to make. I mean, it's it's a more complicated than that. And if you guys want, we could totally do a video explaining like all the, the hows and, and whys of American cinema and and because that's what television. we do. That's our field. Like yeah. that's our specialty. And why it costs so much to do things here, and you know. Yeah. So on and so forth. Just but let us know in the comments. Yeah, you know, know the we listen to you. So. Yeah. so thanks for watching.